Through conservation efforts and successful management practices, we are showing more deer than ever in North Carolina, and the results are also telling us that we have bigger bucks too. Thanks for tuning in. My name is Kyle Keller. I'm a broker and co-owner of Carolina Living in Estates, and today we're gonna to discuss a few topics about deer hunting in North Carolina. We're gonna cover some of the best places to hunt in North Carolina, what to look for when buying hunting land, and what to look for with your lifestyle. So there are a lot of places in North Carolina that are great to hunt, but I'm gonna list off a few of my top favorite places to hunt, which will lead us to our next topic of what to look for in hunting land. Because these are the reasons of why these places are all great to hunt. So some of you already might be familiar with some of these places, because if you go to the Dixie Deer Classic, you're gonna see the wall of all the big bucks in all of these counties you're probably gonna recognize. The best places to hunt, first off, is gonna be the big triangle in between Charlotte, Winston-Salem, and the Raleigh area. That's a very broad geographical area, but if you're gonna be basically north of Charlotte in the Rowan County area, the Iredell County area, lots of agricultural land, they grow big deer, there's lots of deer there. Um, and then obviously if you're north of Winston-Salem in Stokes County and Rockingham County, every single year, huge deer are being taken out of there. If you're following North Carolina Sportsman News or if you're going to the Dixie Deer Classic, Stokes County and Rockingham County, those are the top counties to hunt big bucks in the state. But not everybody has access there um, or not everybody's gonna wanna travel that far. But obviously, if you're, if you're in Stokes County and you're going all the way east to North Greenville, North Carolina, on the Virginia border, all of those counties will hold a lot of big deer. Now, if you're also in the mountain range, Ashe County, North Carolina, on the Virginia and Tennessee border, it's one of my favorite places to hunt. Um, the reason why Ashe County, North Carolina, and basically the, the big, Triangle and the Piedmont region also with bordering those counties from Stokes County all the way north of Greenville. The reason why there's really big deer there is because of the agriculture. It's also because of the hunting pressure. So think about it. A lot of these big cities are gonna hold deer because not everybody's gonna hunt. And so there's a lot of reduced pressure. However, right outside the city limits, you're getting a lot of agriculture. And so the cities are gonna keep the deer safe. The, the cities and the people are gonna keep the coyotes away at a reduced rate. So there's not a lot of pressure on these animals. They're allowed to thrive, they're allowed to grow, which is why people are harvesting and shooting just absolutely just huge bucks right outside the Charlotte, the Winston-Salem area. Um, Kernersville recently had a huge buck taken a couple years back with a bow. Um, obviously, going north of Greensboro and north of Raleigh, I mean, year after year, giant animals. Um, and, uh, and of course, Ash County, North Carolina, big genetics up there because you've you got to have a big animal when you're going to be in the mountain range but there's also a lot of the agriculture and then of course lastly with picking a property what what kind of property is going to fit your lifestyle as a buyer you've got to think of everything from finances and the total purchase price to geographical location like how far you want to drive how hard do you want to work right is it flat agricultural land or is it gonna be hilly where you're gonna be doing a lot more hiking and the terrain's just a lot more aggressive? Or do you wanna have more timber production and, and put in your own ponds, your own food plots? So all of these things that are, are taken into consideration um, when purchasing a property. I hope that was super educational for you so you know where to go and some of the top places in North Carolina to go and hunt. Um, if you're interested in purchasing a property, uh, please contact me at the information below. There's also a ton of public land out there. North Carolina has done a great job of maintaining these properties. Um, so I hope this was helpful. I hope this was educational. Um, please like and subscribe so you can get more information in the future. And good luck out there this season.